Let's see how to add smoking unit for uh, Kablet K97, this 100 version. This one, the board for connecting the smoking unit, it is on the cabin. So we have to first take out the cabin. So here it is the heating unit, this is the motor, connecting wires and the hose. So for the, the cabin, you see, we, I already take out. So under there, we got these two plates. We have to first remove under the cabin. So after remove, at four, before remove, you will see forward have two screws. You can already take out. After remove these two plates, you will see one more screw at the rear side under there. You take out. So totally together, three screws holding the cabin. After remove, you will be able to take out the cabin. So slowly, see from here, the wires are still connected. You can keep like this to see. So one, two, three, three screws under there. You, you, you remove, you will be able to see this one. So from here, you see we got one more, this empty plug. Here is for the smoking unit. And here we see these wires, this black, white, blue one. This one, the black is nothing. This white one is for the smoking unit signal wire. This a little blue, this one, this wire is for the light, uh, for the light signal wire. It is all pulling out from downside to here, you will see. So this is the white wire for smoking signal. This is the blue wire for the light control. This one already connected to here. So this one later we will connect to this uh, additional receiver and we will activate for controlling the smoking unit. So let's see it. This one we will put aside. The smoking unit here, this one is the motor. The motor connection should be the right side, this one. Connect to right side. Here have one M sign. M sign, so connect motor here. This connection wire, one side connecting to this left side, another side connecting to the board under the cabin. So this is the wire you have to connect to under the cabin. So it is here, you will see. That's for the smoking unit, this position. So after uh, the wires from the heat unit, we need to go through under there to remove from, to coming out from here, we will put the smoking unit here. And uh, from the back side, this cover have six screw on the, this point. Six big screw here, I already removed. After remove this six screw here, you will be able to take out this back cover. So the smoking hose go from here for smoking. We will arrange this later. Okay. Okay, for this smoking unit, you add for filling up smoking oil. This one is the hole, but if for first time you have to fill up a lot, it's very slow to fill up from the hole, so take out the cover. Okay, take out the cover. I already put a little inside the oil, so you see inside is only this cotton wire, the cotton rope for suction smoking oil, and the heating wires are circling the, the rope. So you can just open the smoking board Oil. This one oil you can buy from your local, it is cannot send by airplane, so just fill up, pull a little bit inside. One or two minimum liter, only to cover the bottom of the, the rope, it is, it is enough. Yeah, then put back. So these wires we already connected here, under the cabin, this position. And the other side, we go under there to run it through here. And this is the wire 
another end that we are connect to here. So let's put on the cabin. Let's put back. So this wire coming to this end. Let's connect it. This heating unit have already put glue on there to stick on the plate. So this one now we will also put stick. First we see how long is the hose to put there and then we will get a little with a little bit angle because it should be around like this. Then you connect it, find the position, stick on it, good, so the hose no bending, it's all connected, we have to put the hose another side and uh, coming through from the uh, smoking exhaust pipe. Okay, wires connected, all in position, this hose we connect to other end. And here coming to the back side exhaust pipe, go through it. This one actually, if you like, can put glue, but I think no need. You put in position these wires, that way we will arrange it. You pull out a little, this is enough. Inside I already see it. it's no, no banking. So from here it's too long, we cut a little bit. Let's check how long inside. Yeah, like this, it should be okay. So we cutting from here. The hose you can push back a little. It's enough, and then we put back the on the there the six screw. Okay, this is the wires connected from under the cabin. This is another end lead to here. If I plug to here, will be powered on now because I haven't controlled with the switch. This is the smoking, the white wire for controlling. So after setting, we can connect the power. So this one, the additional, this receiver for a channel, the uh, number three and the number four, C3, C4 already used, uh, activated. Now we can use C1 and C2, means channel 11 and channel 12 we can use. We have to activate it. So let's use C1, channel 11. From radio, you go to RX setup, go to I, I bus setup, and the channel 11, not setting yet. Now we are setting it, channel 11. Okay, so from this receiver, channel 11 means C1, and got a key, key 1. You read here, now you have to press key 1 to activate, uh, to activate C1. Press it. Okay, now it is activated, servo 1 means C1, channel 11, okay. So this one C1, channel 11, now it is activated, can use, can control from your radio. Uh, in the meantime, channel 11, you have to set up, not connect now, set up which to controlling the smoking. So function assign, channel 11, go to channel 11. I choose this one for this turning switch for controlling the smoking. So you can control easily how much coming smoke, open up and more and more. Yeah, let's choose VRB. Okay, choose VRB. So channel 11 controlling by VRB. Okay, all set up. Plug it in. So here, left side is for the signal. And this power supply wire connected. Let's see if you can control now. You can go to endpoints to see channel 11, how it's moving, the setup endpoints. So now it's in the middle, zero, going up, switch on. Yeah, motor already start turning. You can hear it. So let, uh, we need to wait a little bit to let the heating heat up the wires. Later we are coming smoke. 
Also, also, first time you fill up oil, the, the cotton inside the cotton rope need to suction oil from the bottom, takes a little time. So. Okay, now it's after heat up, it's coming smooth. The one thing is, if the outlet hose is too long, when it is cold, the oil, the smoking air coming out will be, you see, it's cold, it's like uh, condensed together on the hose, will become smoking oil again. Maybe if too much, it will block the hose. Like if, if you see not coming smoke, better to check if the smoking, the oil, get on the hose to block the hose or not. Okay, let's arrange the, all the wires to put together, not to be tangled all around. Okay, tap it. Put on there, tight. Good, so all the wires here, now looking better. Cut this one, yeah, finish. Should be good. Okay. Okay, smoking unit all finished.